For the first time in over 13 years, Nevada Partnership for Homeless Youth is hosting the Homecoming Gala. The event is a major fundraiser and enables them to support the most vulnerable in our community. Joining us is CEO of the organization Arash Kafori and presenting sponsor Terry Helms, the founder of Helms Helps Foundation. Morning. Welcome, guys. Good, Good morning. morning. Great to have you in. We are happy to be here. Thanks for having us. <laughs> yeah, so we, we mentioned that it's been a little bit over a decade since the first or since the gala has happened. Yeah. What has taken so long to come back? Well, we've been busy helping young people experiencing homelessness since that time. We started the movement to end youth homelessness. We've more than doubled our housing program. We doubled the size of our emergency shelter. We've passed two laws to help young people experiencing homelessness. So we've been really busy. And we thought now is the, first, uh, the perfect time to kind of celebrate all those accomplishments, celebrate the journey coming home, and that's exactly what we're gonna do next Thursday, May 16th. One of the important things to put on an event like this is having a supporting partner, a sponsor. Terry, uh, Helms, um, Helms Foundation obviously getting involved with this. Why was it, why was it important for you to, to make sure you were you know, the supporting sponsor for this event? Well, I, I do matching campaigns with small nonprofits, and I've done a match with, with NPH already. So uh, when, when this opportunity came up, uh, to be the presenting sponsor, I was definitely a number one, and I was also a homeless youth, uh, so I was kicked out of my house, so I was on the streets, and back then, there was no place to go. YMCA, Boys Club, no, no one would take you in because you were a, a child. So something that's so, near and dear to your heart, obviously. Yes. Yep. So, well, yeah. Arash, you said that uh, you guys have been busy with all of these things that you're doing, making an impact in our community. So what are some of the accomplishments that are going to be celebrated at the gala? Yeah, so that evening we have a lot of great things to celebrate. We're going to be celebrating our wonderful funders. We're going to be giving out awards to those organizations and individuals that have really uplifted the issue of youth homelessness and brought resources to bear to make change around it. We're going to be giving out scholarships to young people who have graduated from our program. Current clients are going to be attending our gala as well. There's going to be a live band, there's going to be a whole dance component, there's a homecoming court, boutonnieres. So we're really just trying to help people come back to that place where they were, you know, experiencing homecoming and making sure we bring that same experience to all of our young people experiencing homelessness and to remind the community that these are young people, these are our future, and together we can provide them the best possible runway to get that future that they want. Yeah, talking about, about those kids and the fact that obviously this event has, has gone away for a short time and with the enthusiasm for it coming back, limited amount of tickets available, there, there, there are going to be people who are going to be disappointed and not able to help this time around. But what are other ways that they can support, get involved, you know, boost, champion? How, can they, how else can they help the mission? Absolutely. We at MPHY may be the way to help young people experiencing homelessness, but we need all the love and support for coming from the community in order to do that. So you can come visit our website, www.mphy.org, learn about how you can volunteer, how you can advocate, how you can become a donor, and just learn more about the issue of young people experiencing homelessness, because once you do, you will find a way to get involved whether it's making a donation, being an advocate, or yourself even noticing that someone that you're close to may be experiencing it and doing something about it and knowing where to turn to, which is Nevada Partnership for Homeless Youth. Terry, you mentioned you have a personal connection and wanting to help with this organization. So what are some other things that you've seen or stories and, and the impact that you've seen this organization have on other people? Um. Well, you, if you go to the actual facility and you see, and you see the, the, the youths in there and, and they're, they're all happy and smiles on their faces and, and, and it's just, it's like being in a dorm, you know, it's, it's just a wonderful feeling to, to be there at the same time as they are in, in his facility. Yeah, we, you talked about the facility, you recently opened a, a new center. Yes, yes. Um, how, how's, how's, that, how's that working, operating? Obviously, this is an area that... Part of the funds I'm sure raised from this will help to assist for as well. Absolutely. We just opened our new OVO Center, which is our new Outreach Volunteer and Operations Center, and that's going to help us do more outreach because part of our services is actually going into the street and connecting with young people on the streets because they may not trust adults or institutional figures, so it's important that they know that we exist and that we're willing to come to the streets and bring our services to them and establish that trust right then and there. So there's a lot of things that that facility is going to help us do, more outreach, help us get more volunteers in the door because volunteers are really important to our organization as well because they help young people understand there's actually positive adult role models out there and people adults who actually care about them and their plight and want to do something about it so awesome. yeah. yeah yeah Arash thank you so much for joining us Terry as well we really appreciate it and we appreciate what you're doing in our community as well thank for more you. information on the homecoming gala on Thursday May 16th including purchasing tickets head to NP 
hy.org/gala2024